hey this one shocked me oh hi everyone welcome to my channel my name is jenny and you are in turkey headquarter so guys i just got this news that um queen naomi got engaged on her birthday that she's engaged why some are saying that it was done a day before a day before her birthday why some are saying is done on her birthday i don't really know which one is the truth so seems that queen naomi wants to follow the footsteps of um queen Wurola last that's the ex-wife of oni of ife you know when queen Wurola left the palace she got married after some years and nobody heard about it when people get to know that um, Queen Wurola was married, um, was when she gave birth to, in fact, when she gave birth to her first child. The child is already getting to one year, or maybe seven months to one year before um, the secret was leaked that Queen Wurola is married and had a baby. We were super happy for her. Like, Everyone was super happy for her. And I think that's the same footstep that Queen Naomi wants to take. Maybe um, people have told her or the family have advised her to, like, if she's getting married again, that she do it low-key. Well, with all these things I'm hearing, I'll still um, know what Oni, how Oni of Ife felt about this. Because before, they said that Queen Naomi is still the wife of Oni of Ife since she has not done the rituals to separate herself from the Lua title and all of that. But people are saying that maybe they have done it secretly. They didn't, you know, let the public know. And mind you, on the 15th that was Queen Naomi's birthday, you know, her brother said a prayer that like there is this prayer and this comment that the brother was not comment the post the brother made he said something of Kinomi will get married this year he prayed something like that so maybe Kinomi will maybe Kinomi is in a relationship or maybe Kinomi is engaged for his brother to make that statement that means there is an atom of truth with this um rumor that Queen Naomi got engaged um, on her birthday because for her brother to just pray for her that Queen Naomi is getting married like this year, you know, to a man that will value her. He wrote a lot of things, but he said, like, the way he prayed that prayer, as if he was sure that it's gonna happen. Like, you can go back to his uh, Instagram page, his brother, Beiru, you know, now everything is making sense with those posts the brother was making and other comments that the brother was making in other people that posted queen Nomi and people were saying negative stuff the place they said negative things the brother was saying something so i think the brother was trying to give us a clue when i did that video i was like this young man is sounding confused you called her only of your face um you called her um queen of the source later you call her former queen of the source later clean it and call her queen of the source later call her um or um um only of if you know called her queen no miyoku is she now prayed for her to get married too like i was super confused i was like this young man is confusing people with what he's with what he wrote but right now i think it's not making sense he was giving us a clue. Maybe he don't want to go direct because of bloggers like us, like me, so that I will not take the news and start, you know, broadcasting it. I think they are trying to play smart. They are trying to like do the way uh, Queen Wurola did it. In fact, nobody knew that Olori um, or Queen Wurola was married. When she left the palace, she got married, moved on with her life. You know, she didn't post anything. She post once in a while on Instagram and nobody knows her whereabouts, nobody knows what is happening in her life, a lot of things, but man, it was later that we heard that she has been married 
or maybe they said even after one year she left only uh she left only of you uh, like after one year the divorce something like that i think people or people around or um quinomi's family has decided to follow the that method i'm very sure if this if this um engagement stuff of quinomi is true that means they want to play the role that queen roller played like hiding a lot of things i think it's the best thing to do right now all eyes are on Olori, um, sorry, Queen Naomi, her next move. Everybody is just like eager to know what is happening in her life. And I love it that if this news is actually true, I love it the way they are keeping it secret. But one thing about when you keep something secret and you tell it to someone else that is not family, believe me, you, the person will tell another person that will tell another person, another person will tell another person you know but if actually this is this news is the truth honestly i'm super super happy for her i'm wishing her congratulations in advance and i like it the fact that they're keeping it this way and they should continue to hide the manu like if i talk we know me um already engaged or in a relationship they should continue to hide the man from the public because man what that family went through when we know me married only of ife oh gosh there is no source of name people did not call her people made like some people loved her why some don't don't because they feel that uh maybe she's the reason why um Urola left just like what is happening to Uluri ashley right now people feel that she made quinomi left when quinomi came a lot of people thought she made um queen Urola left so that only only of will marry her you know that kind of thing and when she left only of Ife, oh my goodness the dragon people drag queen nomi and her family they are still dragging her up to now they called them all sorts of names and all of that and i'm i'm happy that if she's getting married again she should learn from her first mistake it's not everything that she will bring to internet um social media i mean because a lot of people are like eager to know what is happening in her life believe me you Quinomi is blessed. I've like I, I've not even heard of this when I, when I did um the other video, and I remember I told you guys that they are going to make a big announcement. I think maybe they decided not to make the announcement again. I think this ring is one of the announcements that Quinomi and family wanted to make on her birthday because the person that I heard it from is from a right source. But I think that they just, I don't know, but I'm not sure. But if at all this is the news, man, congratulations to her. I'm super, super happy for her. Like, um, it's good, like, um, when women or men, um, you know, separate from their first marriage, they should move on with their life. I, I believe that nobody is perfect and we can all find our love if the one you have is not favoring you is not you are not happy in your marriage if separating is the best thing you separate and you find another love quinomi is still young only of if after all has married seven wives so if quinomi got married today it's not a big deal because the man has already moved on with seven wives anyway i'm super happy for quinomi congratulations was the once again if at all this news is the truth and secondly this ring that i used here um i got it from google this is not quinomi's hand and yeah i used this picture for illustration i'm super sorry and i hope you watch this video up to this moment so that you hear that i got this picture from google this is not quinomi's hand please thank you so much and thank you for always coming back to watch my video thank you for subscribing thank you all for all your support for watching my videos and liking sharing thank you so much and i really appreciate thank you and may god bless you